Devaluation and the J-curve. Devaluation to remedy a trade deficit may not work in the short run. Devaluation would work through a process called expenditure switching, where domestic consumers switch to local products and where overseas consumers switch to the economy's exports. This only works if the Marshall Lerner condition is met, which is that the sum of PEDs for exports and imports is greater than 1. This is unlikely in the short run as demand is inelastic. The deficit will get worse, moving from $20 billion to $30 billion. This explains the J-curve path following a devaluation indicating the Marshall Lerner condition is not met in the short run and devaluation causes any trade deficit to worsen.